Well, we're down here at the swimming pool area and it's kind of amazing. It's just like the Bahamas. <laughs> it's an emerald green. I don't know. Hopefully they actually paint it that way. Because I can't imagine the maintenance it would take to clean that up if that's, uh, that's algae. Although, can't really see down into it either. Can't see the bottom. Just like the Bahamas. Yeah, cannot see the bottom. We have a couple of nice slides though, I guess, when uh, it's warm and clean. Don't think we'll be going swimming today. I don't think so. So apparently much of this area is Civil Conservation Corps, CCC stuff. Cool building here. It says bathhouse. Eh, it doesn't look like anything's open. They got the boats in the water. You'd think that they'd want to rent them. Let's go down to the lake. Now the dam here is also built by the CCC and we're gonna go down and check that out a bit. We could go out in a canoe. Couldn't, they're all locked together. Well darn. I wanted to go pedal around. Paddle King Paddle Boats. I'm kind of disappointed. All right, so here's the dam here at uh, Devil's Den. And you might be able to see the water there coming through. That's pretty much what we saw flowing yesterday in Lee's Creek, which is what this pool down here is the headwaters for. And this looks pretty cool over here. Let's check this out. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see the swirls down there. Maybe it was under the water, but now I'm starting to wonder if it's on the water. Maybe a combination of both of different colors we're seeing. Yeah, so all this rock work here is all CCC, and I'm kind of using it as steps. That doesn't look like very likely. I should be able to follow it down around here. Not sure if I'm going to be able to get down or not here. I can't believe I'm doing this after going to Moonshiner's Cave, but that really wasn't all that bad. Looks like there might be a way down right here. Down here at the bottom of the dam. That's kind of cool. It looks like somebody's done some rock art down here. Let's go take a look. Well, I guess until the next flood, people have decided to create their little artistic sculptures. Let's take a quick gander here. It's kind of cool. at the dam and then the little rock art here and the little view downstream here that would be back in the area we camped in last night and then there's trigger over here whining because mom's touching rocks 
And here's Carol creating her own rock art. walking back by the dam or towards the dam I guess saw this up here kind of wondering what it was some sort of picnic area pavilion I guess and look at these massive beams over here big logs pretty cool all right so I am up here on top and going into the picnic area here nice glow on the wood up here big fireplace nice here from the end the fans even moving just in the breeze yeah the chimney here is just down below the picnic pavilion i was just at down in the field below This might be of interest. I'm going to zoom into it and let you read it all. Yeah, Devil's Den State Park is the most intact CCC built park in Arkansas. So I'm at the Recreation Hall, apparently. All right, pretty cool. Well, for our second day or night here at Devil's Den, and it's only about noon, so I suppose we could have moved on. It's just, uh, yeah, we probably could have, but we have time. So anyway, we did uh, change our campground uh, to a non-electric campsite. Still has showers. So, I mean, you know, it's a really pretty campground. I there weren't wonder. very many people in it when we drove through yeah. this morning. Yeah. Uh, we're hoping the bees won't be so bad in this campground. Carol is more optimistic than I am. Trigger doesn't want to have to spend the whole rest of the day in the back <laughs> of the truck. <laughs> really? Oh. So our site might be in shape. It's not in shape. Hard to tell what's well, going to happen. We can. This is our spot right here, right at the end. Yeah, we, we have no idea what's going to happen the rest of the day. We're going to know we're going to have hot dogs <laughs> now. And, Soon, uh, yeah. Well, we did decide to go for a little walk here down to this creek that's just below our camp spot. Lee Creek. The other side of Lee Creek from where we were yesterday. We have more of a dirt bank here instead of those nice rock luffs. Apparently, according to Carol, there it is, a large pool this way. Yeah, so here's this pool, and quite honestly, I'm wondering if that isn't just a beaver dam right here. Doesn't look like it's a man-made anything. I hope that it's a beaver dam. We have an armadillo here. He's got his head up. He's like sniffing the air or something. I know I can see that, but I can't. I'm not seeing him in the viewfinder. <sighs> Finally found him. There's the armadillo. The backside of the armadillo. Well, he's rooting, isn't he? And that's our armadillo for the day. 
All right, so we're on the other side of this pond that we found here. Definitely looks like a beaver dam. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can see some fish down here. Let's see if we can, little tiny fish, if I can find, there they are. Yeah, so this area that's just above the creek and that beaver pond that we showed you is all very slabby type rock. In fact, looks like another like lava flow to me, more or less smooth. A lot easier to hike on than that large boulder or large rocks that we've been doing. Well, that was a nice short little walk for the afternoon and we'll get ourselves back to camp and get those showers that we've been promising ourselves. I don't know if you can pick up this water coming here out of the beaver dam area or the silt anyway. Very red. All right, so I'm just coming back out of that little path there to the beaver pond beaver dam area and this is our camp spot uh, we picked one here right next to the trail area as not a lot around us we'd have this whole buffer parking area which may be the walk-in campers use that parking area there are some tent sites that you walk back into but not a lot of people here it's almost four o'clock and Basically, there's four camps set up in here. One of them's way across the way. You can see the tent over there. And then these people just came in as one group. Then the other one's all the way at the far end. So, pretty nice. Pretty nice.